Hi, good evening. My name is Leticia Cruz. This is um, Biology Week 4 Lab. Today is July 31st, um, 2019, and I'm going to go over the results of my lab for the bio um, chemical testing for the microbes uh, with the menthol red and the boss poster and catalyst testing. Um, so I'm going to show you my area here. I'm going to show you some of the stuff I used today. My lighter and the candle to do my sterilization. I use this to um, gather the uh, microbes for one of them. Um, these are all the used stuff that I use. Um, I use the pipette. Uh, the bra, the, uh, everything that I'm disposing of is in the um, bleach uh, solution. Um, I'm going to clean everything out before I can dispose of it. As you can see, some of the stuff is already floated to the bottom. Um, I have my alcohol for here. And then I have the dyes that I used today, um, the menthol red. So that was in the first for the first experiment. Um, the Barrett A, uh, that was for the second one, and this for Barrett B also for the second one. Um, I'm going to dispose a little later. My scissors, my clean space, and then um, an actual results here. So. The first test um, for the menthol red test. Um, here is my first one. The staphyl epidermis um, and the results for that one. We're negative. Um, it's been sitting for a little bit, but you can see it's mostly yellow versus the red. Um, and for the E. coli, it's mostly red. It's been sitting for a while though. Um, for the second testing, you know, you use the Barrett's um, gel for the E. coli, a gel reactant. Um, the E. coli was. Uh, negative and the um, staphylococcus epidermis was positive um, you can see it here more of a little red for the epidermis on the top and then the E. coli you can see that's yellow so that was a negative um, and the the last of them um, is the uh, slides that we had to show um, with the catalyst for the E. coli as well as the um, Staphylococcus. Let me go ahead and show you those results. There they're labeled. The slides are each labeled. And um, the circles areas where the um, let me show you a little closer. Slides are all labeled, and the circular areas where the um, sample was was um, put, and then the hydrogen peroxide was added. Um, and this, the reaction was. Um, very quick, there was small um, bubbles for both, both tests were positive, um, for the E. coli and the stuff the Um Had a little bit of a problem because I didn't incubate for as long, um, as, and uh, I believe the reaction with the last test for the catalyst would have um, been a little more apparent, but other than that, the um, experiment went well, so thank you so much. And until next time, have a great night.